Mm. It is. We are going to stay dry one more day, and then rain is on the way for Thursday. So here's a live look right now on Aniston. And don't worry, no rain coming coming from all these clouds right now in East Alabama. Let's kept our temperatures down just a bit today. So we're in the mid to upper 60s this evening. It's 66 right now in Aniston. Not too humid out there. Humidity at 50%. So feeling pretty comfortable throughout the evening, but we are going to be cooling down. Cloud cover will grab gradually erode away and we're going to be chilly when you wake up tomorrow morning near the 70 degree mark though in West Alabama. Those are where warmer spots are this evening. Look at all the cloud cover on satellite, but don't worry, not going to be quite as cloudy tomorrow. And hey, at least we're not along the Gulf Coast right now where they're getting soaking rainfall, not what they need right now, especially down in South Texas as well. Wet weather stays well to our south this evening, but we will be tracking what happens or the remnants of what's left of Willa. This is a category three hurricane about to make landfall in Mexico. As this storm weakens, the energy from this storm is going to create another disturbance that's going to be our rainmaker by Thursday. So here's the timing and the wet weather continues to track through Mexico. Notice how it just kind of breaks apart, but the energy of this system is going to create another area of low pressure in the Gulf, and that's going to start to work its way towards us by Thursday. So we're going to stay dry until we hit Thursday. Thursday afternoon. Heaviest rainfall will be to our south, but still expecting a good soaking rainfall across much of the area throughout the day on Thursday, continuing through Friday. You can see all that wet weather finally starting to clear out throughout the day on Friday. So for the next day, though, we are going to stay dry, and it does look like we are going to see improving weather by the weekend. So tonight, our temperatures will be tumbling because cloud cover really starts to thin out. By tomorrow morning, we're going to be in the 40s. So going to be a cool one again this evening. Upper 40s in Birmingham, Shelby County, as well as Chilton County will be in the upper 40s. But lower 40s for Coleman in our valleys towards Gadsden, as well as more mountainous areas in East Alabama are going to be slightly cooler. Now we will warm up nicely tomorrow. It's going to be a really nice fall day, mostly sunny skies with temperatures in the low 70s, even some upper 60s for North Alabama. So a cool day again tomorrow, but then that's when and the rain will arrive by Thursday. So staying dry tomorrow, temperatures in the low 70s. Our temperatures are going to be very cool both Thursday and Friday because of the widespread rain. About almost all of us will see at least a stray shower for Thursday, gradually clearing out throughout the day on Friday, not expecting any thunderstorms. Now by Saturday for the Magic City Classic, we should be fine. May see a stray shower possible throughout the weekend, but most of us will still Stay dry with temperatures in the upper 60s, so feeling like fall through next week.